Hi all, this video is going to be a simple explanation about project library in DaVinci Resolve. Simply, project library is a folder location which contains all the things related to your DaVinci Resolve project. DaVinci Resolve connect this project library from project manager. In project manager, on top left, if you click that icon, you can see all the project library. On default, DaVinci will create project library for you in this location. And if you want to create new project library, you can do that by using add project library option. There will be two options. Create option can be used to create project library while connect option can be used to link the project library to DaVinci Resolve. Just type the name for your project library and use browse option to browse the folder to create or connect the project library. On this project library, by clicking the info icon, it will show more details and you can backup your project library using backup option. Choose backup and select the location, it will do a backup. Only issue is that there is no progress bar, so just wait and successful window will be shown and if you want to restore your project library you can do that by using restore option found at the top right open file location will open this project library folder and inside this project library folder settings folder contain delivery preset related data user folder contains the project data as well as project settings lastly soundlib.db file is the database file for all the sound you added to sound library in DaVinci Resolve. Inside the user folder, guest folder, there will be three folder. Config folder contain your project settings preset related data. Project folder contain all your projects. The structure of this project folder is same as that of project manager. Each project is represented as folder and inside this folder, you can find project.db file which is the project for your DaVinci Resolve. If you have this project.db file then you can simply create a new folder and name it what you want for your project and place this project db folder inside this folder. Then when you reopen DaVinci Resolve you will see a new project with the folder name that you created about the user db file and project metadata catch folder i don't know much about that and i couldn't find any data related to those things so that's it that's all about this video guys i hope you guys find this video useful if you do so the like button and don't forget to subscribe